Hello everyone, this is RTR here and you are back for Newcastle against Aston Villa for the English Premier League. And uh, before I begin, I'd like to say some sad news because my Windows Expression Encoder, well the program that I use to screencast uh, videos for you guys, um, apparently it's the free version and it does not allow me to go beyond 10 minutes. Now YouTube just recently you know, launched the 15 minute uh, video playback and I'm sad to say that I cannot capitalize on that and my videos will continue to you know, feature first half and second half as always now if you really really want the 15 minute videos uh, just feel free to donate to my blog <laughs> you can donate at my blog you know, just write down the little tab there that's a little heart that's the donate button or you can just wait for me to gather enough money and time to you know, invest in videos okay and moving along let me just go to the formations to see our starting lineup and you can see that today we are against Aston Villa 442 now Aston Villa is a very strong team just that you know, for this season they are lacking in strikers or forwards you can see right here Federico Makita is up in the front now uh, this boy here is actually a loan from Manchester United and Valery Bojinov is you know, his striking partner and you can see that you know, he, they are so tight in strikers that they have to loan from Manchester United to supplement the attack but all in all the midfielder is really really strong you have Ashley Young and James Miller the two you know, wingers and yes the midfielder section cent the central midfielder section is actually still very strong now how do I approach the game I man mark all of these four with my midfielders as well according to the positions and of course man marking their strikers with my central defenders alright and that's how I play and that's how I roll and let's just get the match going Alright, you are going to view the main stand pers camera pers uh, perspective and yes, I'm still rotating around the perspective uh, just to find out which one is better so feel free to let me know Alright, and you can see that uh, Newcastle is having a good possession because we are actually attacking or it's just the first minute or the second minute of the game so we cannot really tell if it's going to continue but uh, looking at the way my players are playing right now I'm quite encouraged alright uh, they are trying to find space for attacks and yes Leon Best running in and oh he tries a shot but it's deflected off one of the uh, Aston Villa's players and I wonder if you can see the raindrops right here <laughs> I can see them but I'm not so sure if the video contact allows you to see them anyway uh, it's pretty cool and right now David Benny oh my goodness David Benny tries along uh, to shoot within the box but Brad Fredo did very well by parrying the ball away well done and right now we are still having the possession looks like Newcastle oh that was close Leon Best nearly had a shot in but Richard Dune actually slide at the correct time uh, good job by Richard Dune alright we have a corner by Raphael van der Vaart. he crosses into the box but it's headed wide and alright uh, we have a goal kick right now and you can see that yes Newcastle is really really doing well for possession and we are actually creating chances but the defense of Aston Villa is not allowing us to you know, break the wall and right now we are not sure why <laughs> there's uh, such a pause in the game I guess Shola and Milby was talking to the referee uh, but anyway uh, it's now the 20th 27th minute going to our 28 and right now um, the ball is going wide because Josie Henry is in pain and yes Ashley Young is in pain too another player with a little cross uh, first aid icon up there oh that was close Stefan Warnock denying one of my players from shooting and right now we have Rafael van der Vaart going to take the corner and yes somebody's injured here little first aid icon and he throws the ball in and it's cleared away by James Miller. David Bentley fouls. No, sorry. Yes, David Bentley fouls Bojinov. And yes, we have a free kick for 
Ashley Young. Uh, but the free kick uh, went wide, deflected off a defender, I believe. And right now, we have a corner. Alright, he throws the ball in. And okay, it's cleared again. It's another corner for Aston Villa. Alright, we are in the 38 minutes. 7 minutes ago for half time. And looks like Newcastle, although having the better of the possession, still un unable to you know, have a goals lead. And right now, and oh, okay, the ball went wide for Stefan Warnock for a throw in. And he throws to Petrov, Diera, Stefan Warnock, Petrov. Actually, Young trying to find space. Alright, maybe he might strike the ball, and yes, he did. But the ball went over the crossbar. And right now, Tim Cool is you no know, taking his own sweet time to place the ball and to cross the ball. To, no, not exactly cross, a short pass to. Abu Bakaria Kubu and right now we are attacking from the left wing. Seems like we like the left wing a lot. <laughs> Rafa Van der Vaart and oh David Bentley. He should have shot. My goodness. I guess he was trying to find a better you know, opportunity to shoot but he just wasted it and Josie Enrique shoots into Brad, Brad Fredo's hands. And right now uh, Rafa Van der Vaart tries to oh my goodness. What well, a good long shot by Rafa Van der Vaart and my players try to uh, follow up but the ball just wasn't to our favor. And right now uh, Brad Fredo is gonna take the free kick. Alright. He throws the ball to the to my part of the pitch and oh Nicholas Bediso fouls one of the players. That was really unnecessary. But uh, anyway, the free kick is gonna is so far away from the goal. It's not even a threat. Oh my goodness! James Miller. My goodness, he nearly scored, really, that was a very good opportunity from Aston Villa, but he wasn't on target and that's a pity. And right now we are attacking from the right wing, and yes, trying to create chance, Shula MUB, he floats the ball into the, bo uh, the box, but Leon Bess just didn't connect to the ball well, so the ball isn't to the back of the net, and right now we are at half time. Stay tuned for the second half and if you like my videos, please subscribe to my YouTube channel at RTR Home Manager or you can visit my blog at RTR Home Manager site. Sorry, there's no RTR in my blog's name, sorry. <laughs> Again, my domain is at footballmanagersite.com. Alright, I see you for the second half.